Arena at the 102nd Rose Bowl, where number six Stanford just defeated number five Iowa in spectacular fashion, 45 to 16. The upcoming 2016 season could be the Jacksonville Jaguars' best yet. The offseason promotion of Todd Wash to defensive coordinator has already made a positive impact on the team. I want you to take me on a chant. Now, you guys got to be louder than the home team. Oh, heck yeah. You got it? All right, go. You've seen Deshaun Jackson do it. You've seen Kalen Clay do it. Now, Vic and Weary adds his name to the list. I'm talking about players who drop the ball before they even cross the goal line. We got a pretty good game going tonight, but right now I have someone very special with me. The one and only, number 22, legendary Sharks defenseman, Dan Boyle. In 2015, the San Diego Chargers played 15 games that were decided by a touchdown or less. Unfortunately, their 3-11 record shows that they were on the wrong side of some really close games. It's Courtney, everyone. Say hello. <laughs> so, holy war last week. Crazy game. Tell me about the preparation up until the game. What was the atmosphere like on campus? Um, atmosphere was amazing. Numbers. What do they mean in sports? Besides stats and averages, numbers have a bigger meaning to players. Whether it's superstition, a memorial of someone lost, or tradition, the numbers they wear represent who they are. I'm here with Evgeny Novakov and his lovely date, Tabitha. Well, what does this event mean to you tonight, 25 years of Teal? Over here on the right hand side, it is crazy! What is it about this rivalry that gets these guys so pumped? With the eighth overall pick, the Falcons find themselves in a position to get some big name recruits. A hole the Falcons are looking to fill is on the offensive line. A potential grab could be Stanford's Andrus Peet. The 6'7", 310-pound All-American is a monster on the line. Or the Falcons could use their first pick on the other side of the ball. All right, let's talk stats for a minute. 1,093 games, 163 goals, 442 assists, and 17 years in the league. Kevin Hogan wrapped up his college career winning two out of three Rose Bowl appearances. Not a bad way to go out. For Get Sports Focus, I'm Kaylee Krish. I'm joined now by Christy Yamaguchi and Brett Hedekin. How are you guys looking forward to this night? What does this mean to you? Kaylee Chris here at Levi Stadium for the 2015 Friday Night Lights. I'm here with Wilcox running back Marie Turituri. This week, the Cal Bears will head to Arizona to take on the Sun Devils in week four. As for Vic, we think he learned his lesson. Oh, definitely. Never, never again. <laughs> We saw kind of a wider range of weather out there today, getting ready for this season. We had a little bit of hail and and sun and rain. So is that something you're familiar with, being from Colorado? Yeah, definitely. I think, you know, coming coming from Colorado, you know, you never know what you're going to get. Tell me about that journey going from being an undrafted player to one of the best defensemen in the league. Uh, people are probably sick of me talking about it, but I was an underdog growing up. I was kind of overlooked, and uh, I used that as my strength. Ramsey combines his great vision, anticipation, and instincts to create turnovers and get his hands on the ball. He shows great potential as an edge rusher and is versatile enough to play on special teams as well. While in training camp, the Jags will need to work with Ramsey on his strength to be able to finish off those off-balance tackles. The added weapon in Jalen Ramsey will create more opportunities for the Jaguars defense to put additional points on the board. Kaylee Chris here for Get Sports Focus. Football is back, people. We are here at the farm for the 2015 Cardinal and White scrimmage game. I'm here with Coach Roy Sommer, the all-time winningest coach in AHL history. Give it up for him. All right, Coach. 637 wins. How does that feel? Now I noticed that you changed your number this year. So what was that about? Uh, well, I've been I was five all my high school, and it's my favorite number, and I couldn't get it last year, so I figured I might as well get it this year. You took it this year. You're moving up. As the Chargers plan to move the franchise to Los Angeles, they need a true playmaker, and Joey Bosa is sure to become a fan favorite. We'll do a little we'll do a little Instagram post here. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. Awesome. Well, good luck today. Thanks.